I had the hope that we would be better golfers than yesterday, but I wasn't quite convinced it could happen, and it more than happened. It exceeded expectations. Taking lessons from Crystal will make you better in a day. Drives and chips and putts, everything was better. Everything was better. Hey guys, Christo Garcia, My Swing Evolution. I hope you're having a very amazing Masters Week. Today's Friday, and oh my gosh, Tiger Woods started out seven strokes back, and before he teed it up, he's only four strokes back. Totally crazy. So that little open was from my friend Andy. He came out to the intensive this last weekend, and it is such an honor to work with folks like this. I'll tell you, one of the things I told everybody at the beginning was a quote by Michelangelo who said, I saw the angel in the stone and I carved until I set him free. So Andy has a very good action in his golf swing, you know, and he was very frustrated. But what he needed to do was build a little better structure into his address and we tweaked a couple things with his engine by using a baseball bat and we did a little speed training and I'm telling you we set that angel free he picked up 10 to 20 miles an hour in a weekend he's got great touch around the greens and he's got a lot of potential to be a very good golfer you know but I'll tell you something there's something about the game it's such a difficult and tricky game that if you don't have a little bit of guidance, you can be adrift on the ocean forever looking for any life preserver you can get. Because, you know, it sucks when you're a second-class golfer and you feel that you should be a first-class golfer. And I believe everybody can be a first-class golfer. So I'm going to pick it up uh, where I'm working with Andy on his driver swing. And we really get it worked out so that you know, he really didn't have a lot of big problems in his game. He just needed to tweak some things. And now what we're doing is we're staying in contact and he's refining everything that we worked on through the intensive. And he said he's had breakthroughs every day this week. So without further ado, let's watch a little bit of my work with Andy. Whatever that that swing was with the with the, the ball with the flatter, yeah, you're gonna hit the ball. Eighty-seven. Okay. Starting at eighty-seven. <laughs> Feel free to take two or three more, right. and you can go as fast as you want to go. Joe, your swing is looking a lot more on plane. Your hands okay? Yeah. I haven't worked on it. This fast <laughs> one yet. 91. 91. Wow. All right. Is he a tape or is this it? Yep. So, um, can you show me uh, what we were working on with like a little, yeah. a little more baseball swing? Uh, up more? Yeah. Yep. Okay, now do that and just hit that tee with no ball. Same thing. Okay, what's the speed? Nine miles an hour. Nine times three, 27 yards. It's a 27 yard difference between those two ball swings. See if you can put that on this ball. Just imagine it's not even there. This is why I call it a perfect circle. It's like the ball, there is no ball. It's like matrix stuff.
Oh. Wow, that's the action that we want in our golf swing. Uh, you know, like Joe said, you're posting up and hitting off your left side. Now, did you think you weren't supposed to do that in a golf swing? Yes. Why? Uh, because instruction, reading, magazines. It can, it can, it just, uh, all that stuff just gets in your head. I mean, it feels, when I do it, it feels completely natural. Like, I'm not trying to do anything. Man, you put that on a golf ball, it's going to go a mile. Yeah. Wow. guys, so let's cut to the chase. Here's my old golf swing. And here's my new golf swing. Five years ago, I started a YouTube channel and I wanted to improve my golf swing by using Ben Hogan's five lessons. Well, guess what? It worked. In this video, I break down everything that I learned over my long journey to learn to swing like Ben Hogan. And now you can learn the very same techniques that I use to become the golfer I always wanted to be. Now